We're out here in District 4 on the corner of Tramini and Carmel here. We've had this consistent problem for a while. It's been like this. Um, there are reasons why we haven't gotten to it. It was a, a hole in the ground where the ground was falling in. I'm out here with um, our public works director, Kenny Melvin. He's going to tell you exactly what took so long for us to get to, what was wrong with it, and what's going to be done, and how long people are going to be inconvenienced. Again, we're sorry that people are inconvenienced, but we have to take care of this. Kenny? Uh, what transpired is obviously uh, we have a, a little bit of a mess, but the pipe in the ground sunk, causing uh, you know an opening in the pipe, allowing dirt to infiltrate, which then allows the concrete to sink and cause a hole. So, being that we have a situation with an energy uh, equipment sitting there, now we're working with multitudes of uh, you know ent entities that are involved. So. That's why it's taken so long. We didn't want to do this several weeks back because of the cold weather. We we're anticipating, you know, possibly having to uh, have some residents be without power now. Fortunately, they're not without power now, but uh, you know, that you can see they're working and uh, it should take a few weeks to finish the whole project. It will be passable today or tomorrow. And uh, you know, that, basically is the end of it uh, you know hopefully we can get it done rather quick and again like Kenny said I mean it is inconvenient hopefully it doesn't last too long maybe a couple of weeks it just takes a long time as Kenny was speaking you saw the old pipe coming out those are the things those are the infrastructure problems we have here in the city of Kenner we have to get these things addressed we're trying to get them addressed and this falls under a street repair emergency repair situation Public Works Department is paying for this, and the city of Kenna, obviously, and we're getting it done for all the constituents out here in the neighborhood, plus anybody who uses it. So, you know, again, thank you for your patience. We appreciate it, and we'll continue to stay Kenna proud.